What can I recover under the FDCPA? Hi, this is Consumer Protection Attorney Bill Clanton, and I've helped hundreds of consumers, regular folks like me and you, deal with debt collection harassment, inaccurate credit reporting, and other consumer-related matters. In this video, I'll answer a question that I get a lot. Um, what do I get under the FDCPA? What can I recover when somebody harasses me um, when they're collecting a debt? This is a great question. The FDCPA was enacted to stop debt collection harassment. You know, it's the Fair Debt Collection Practices Act. And it says that you can recover your actual damages. Actual damages. What are actual damages under the FDCPA? Well, if you overpay a debt, you have hard money actual damages. If you pay a fee that's not owed, then you have mon monetary out-of-pocket damages. Also, mental anguish or emotional distress. This is not as common as it used to be. Debt collectors have cleaned up a lot. The FDCPA has done a good job of this, but it still happens. If a debt collector calls you names, harasses you, chases you down, uh, commits acts of violence against you, things like that, then those are compensable, meaning you can get a monetary award for your suffering for your pain, for your damages. Statutory damages. Now, you don't have to have actual damages to bring an FDCPA case. If they violate the law, if they tell you the wrong thing, if they make a misrepresentation to you, and it doesn't rise to the level of you suffering a heart attack or going to the hospital or you losing your appetite or getting sick, then you can still recover your statutory damages. Statutory damages are up to $1,000. Most debt collectors are willing to settle these cases for the $1,000 in statutory damages. Now, you can also recover in a class action. Class actions under the FDCPA are often brought for what's called letter violations. If a debt collector misstates your rights or gives you the wrong number, or makes threats to you that they can't take in a letter, or there's all kinds of letter violations, but if there is a letter violation, then you can bring a class action. Under a class action, the members of the class are entitled to receive the lesser of 1% of the debt collector's net worth, or $500,000. Now that's split up amongst the class. The class can have tens of thousands of people in it, so there's not, most debt collectors, 1% of most debt collectors' net worth is not $500,000. But even if it is, then that $500,000 is split amongst the members of the class. The bigger debt collectors, Portfolio Recovery Associates, Midland, those guys have net worths, 1% of their net worth is more than $500,000. But most of your middle-level middle debt collectors don't have a net worth that is cl close to 1% of it is close to $500,000. It's usually much, much less. Okay, so you can recover the costs of the action and reasonable attorney's fees. What does that mean? That means, I say this in a lot of my videos, that if you hire an attorney to do an FDCPA's, FDCPA case for you, they should not charge you any money because they can recover the costs of the action and their reasonable attorney's fees from the debt collector. That's right. The debt collector has to pay your legal fees. That means they pay me the number of hours I put in times my hourly rate is what I demand from the debt collector to resolve one of these cases, plus your actual damages and your statutory damages. So if you have been harassed by a debt collector and you're wondering what you should do, then you should call a lawyer because you can recover actual damages, statutory damages, costs and attorney's fees. It should not cost you a dollar to bring an FDCPA case, to hire a lawyer to bring an FDCPA case, because they get paid by the debt collector at the end of the case. Yeah, let that sink in. A lot of people can't believe it, but that is the law. So if you have any questions about damages in an FDCPA case, give me a call.
if you're ready to bring an FDCPA case, give me a call. If a debt collector has been harassing you and you're ready to turn the tables, give our office a call because we're ready to help you out. I hope you learned something from watching this video. Please subscribe to my channel and thank you for watching.